Okay. Monsters are ready to break free, but there's still one thing left to do. Okay, I did not realize that this is going to take place at a carnival. And if it doesn't, I'm going to be very disappointed. Happy Halloween, Op Punk! Hi, I'm Fate Touched, and this is me playing games. And Odd Punk has candy. I have candy too, but I'm not eating anymore because it would probably end badly. Happy Halloween! This is the third Halloween Chronicles game. Uh, if you missed the first two, the first one, our parents apparently were monster hunters. They took pictures of monsters and it trapped them onto photographs. And... They somehow broke out because this little clown was sad that he wasn't a big evil monster. And he tried to release the Headless Horseman. That was the first game. It was a little on the weird side. And in the second one, the Boogeyman was banished to like the other dimension and his, his evil minions were trapped in ma three masks. And of course, our family found them because our family is really bad at being monster hunters. And all of our family got turned into monsters because they wore the masks. And we had to save them from the masks and we succeeded. So I have no idea what this is now. I guess the monsters are trying to break out of somewhere else, I assume. I kind of hope it's at a carnival though. That would be cool. But let's find out, shall we? <gasps> Yay, custom mode. I think they had custom mode in the last one, but I'm very happy about that. Uh, is it gonna, da, 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 we do not need that. We do not need that or that. And we can, yep, the last one did. I remember having the skips down to zero. Ta da! -da! Hello, dearest niece. I can't believe it's been 15 years. We have so much catching up to do. You've never even met my family. I'm hosting a fair in Scratchtown this Halloween. Perhaps you can join us. With love, Uncle Pierre. Is this the same uncle from last time or a different uncle? Because the last uncle, which was in game two, owned a curiosity shop where he housed magical items, but then he didn't figure out that the masks that he had were evil and was playing around with them. Hosted by the one and only Pierre Sullivan. Okay, if this is our uncle, it is a different person. Is a skeleton. Oh, he doesn't do anything. Oh, look, we get to collect voodoo dolls. At least these look like voodoo dolls. In the last game, they looked like um, dolls made of string.
Oh, that's our hint button. Okay. Is that a lockpick? Yeah. He's missing his amulet. Can't I take some candy? Wait, was that a ring? Oh, I guess I have to find rings too. The bird stole the bell. Ha! My voice isn't loud enough. You've never met me in real life. My voice is loud enough to wake the dead. He's a creepy pumpkin. Dude! The house across from my parents' house tied a red balloon to their sewer grate. It was awesome. Tasks. And a spur. Ooh, look! It's Ot Punk's favorite, the claw game! That raven stole the bell. A lot of unnecessary special effects in this game. Okay. So, what do I have that can... Oh, I can put this on the vampire. Okay. Oh, lame. You saw Dune and the original Ghostbusters? Or the, is there a new Ghostbusters that I completely missed? Because I remember somebody saying something about it. The original one, okay. Wait, the original one was how long? New one's coming out in November. Okay, these are some cool claw game prizes. All right, let's see. So we need a bat, a cowboy, and a devil. A bat, a cowboy, and a devil. There's the cowboy. He's funny. That was. That's not the devil, really. Okay. Uh, a mummy, which I saw. There he is. A spider. I have one of those spider toys, except his um, markings are orange instead of red. It was much shorter than Dune. <laughs> Most things are shorter than Dune. Dune is very long. Why do I not see the bat? That's a cute ghost. Oh, there's the bat. Oh, the bat is so cute. And a devil and... Oh, there's a ghost. <laughs> oh, and the devil is a bear. This is definitely a devil or a demon or something. All right. The dead bride. She needs flowers. Well, that whatever it is stole them. That wasn't very nice. A clown who is missing his red nose. Oh, that's a cool monster. Oh, evil bunny. Don't like that. A pirate who apparently is missing a hat. A voodoo doll. How would the witch get around with a broom? And a witch. Oh, the voodoo doll lost a button. Boy, all those cool toys, and all we got was a noisemaker. Psh. I mean, granted, we need it, but still. That was the dumbest toy in there. All those other toys were way cooler. And we got a bell. Oh, I'm so glad you could make it. Please, come in, and welcome to my wonderful fair. Welcome, one and all, to the grand opening of the fair. Our guest of honor has arrived. So, the competition can finally begin. And to the winner, the grand prize. A chance to leave here alive. <laughs> that took a turn rather quickly, didn't it? People with that kind of mustache are always evil in these games. <laughs> oh no, a bush. How will we ever escape? I wonder if he is actually evil or if he's being controlled by someone. It's kind of hard to tell with these games. What is that? And I'm collecting potions. I'm collecting like 15 things. Looks like some emblems are missing. There's something inside the pumpkin. I'll need a wedge to split it. 
Uh, since it looks like that's made of concrete, probably yes. Electrical tape. Uh oh, I guess there's not enough wire. Make the balloons fly away. I'm brave enough to look behind the curtains, but I need something to hold it open. How about a spur? How about if you just hold it open yourself? Lazy. Okay. A GPS. Which no one needs anymore because we have phones. Hammer. Scraper. Uh, lockpick. Which we just found lying around. I'm pretty sure you need like a license to use a lockpick. Pretty sure. Okay. I don't think the game makers know what year it is either. Oh, I should have looked. This one is from uh, last year, 2020. I, I'm pretty sure it was October 2020, but I know it was uh, last year. The handles are missing. I mean, technically one is still there, but I get what you're saying. More balloons. Evil clown. Okay, so I guess... No, huh? Can I use that? No? Wire. Oh, that's for the merry-go-round. Oh, that's interesting. I figured there was probably laws around lockpicks, though. Generally speaking, you don't really want the general public to have access to... Whoops. Wrong place. To lockpicks. Because that would be dangerous. It's a ghost. And he blew out the candles. That was rude. Tunnel of Horror. Hey, I'm Foster. You must be my cousin. Dad told us a lot about you. I don't understand what Dad is doing, but he's acting really strange. Our manor is at the end of this tunnel. He must have gone there. We can get there faster in a ride car. Here, you'll need this. Okay, so probably he's being possessed then. Foster, yeah. That's one I haven't heard before. Looks like a code. I should write it down in case it's important. It's fair, I guess. That was different. Okay. Oh, I guess I need this. Set the button so none of the columns, rows, or connecting five-digit strings have duplicate numbers. Select the button to change its number. Note some note that some buttons can't be changed. Okay. None of the columns or rows or connected five-digit numbers have duplicates. So like this has to be one, two, three, four, five. All right. Let's take this one, two, three, four. Five. Let's take this one. And this one. This can be one. This can be two, three. Four, five, three, five, two, four, and then There's no easy way for my brain to do this. One, two, five. This can't be tested before. One, two, one, three, five, two, one, one, three, four, one, not one. Three, I just one. Nice! I didn't think I was close to figuring that out. Okay. Scarecrow has a box. The Wolfman. I don't think spurs are usually that sharp. Alright, fine. I'll leave you alone. Okay, what is this missing? A start button. 
I would think there would be controls somewhere else, but that's fine. All right, let's go open up the pumpkin. There's a flashlight inside there. It's a bit weird. Oh, look, the flashlight's broken. It needs batteries and a start button. Who would have guessed? Right. Okay. Where was the thing? Oh, it's over here. I mean, I might also need a bulb. I just can't see the front of it. We don't know yet. All right, let's see. Wheat, metal, whatever that is. Is that that? Yeah, I guess. And an anchor. Pierre Sullivan's Diary. I'm tired of traveling to run my fairs. I miss my family. I wish I could spend more time with them. I'll organize one last big fair and invite all my relatives. That will be so much, that will be such fun. Okay. And a snake key. <laughs> if you loved your family, why would you name your kid Foster? And all, and another pumpkin. Pumpkin, pumpkin, pumpkin. You know what I didn't have any of this year? Those candy corn pumpkins. Oh, look, it's the hat from the first game. And a bat. Hat, bat. They rhyme. Ah, uh, can I use, oh, that is for that. I mean, either that or they're all back at the house. I don't know. Oh, that's cool. Look, the eyeball follows me. Whee! Okay. <clears throat> All right, let's see. We need a bat and a rose. An eyeball. Oh, eyeball was fun. Uh, and a spider. And there's a spider too. And... Is that? I'm so bad at Zodiac. I don't actually remember what that one is. I know whatever that is. I forget the name of them. There's the spirally thing with the three twirly bits is a specific thing. I am very good at this. Give me the thing. Thank you. I need two more feathers for the dream catcher. And a hourglass. All right, and a bat. There's the bat. And a demon head or something? That's not this, is it? No. Oh, this thing. Whatever that is. Looks like it's supposed to be a pumpkin. Kind of. All right, and a ring. And hands. The complete encyclope encyclopedia of palm mystery. That's probably not how you pronounce that. Can we read our fate from the lines of, on our palms? If we see trouble there, can it be prevented? Fortune telling from the lines on the hand. Surprisingly, the lines can change, disappear, appear, intersect, or suddenly disperse. This indicates a change in the fate of, a, of man. Okay. Oh, there's the ring right in front of my face. Don't be afraid to walk toward your fears. Follow the boy. He'll lead you to what you seek. Oh, that's very pleasant, Aunt. Good for you. Oh, look. The robot fortune teller has a, the button to start the thing. Hey, you should totally have a robot for, fortune teller in your robot book, Aunt. That would be funny. No, but I meant like an actual robot fortune teller, like from the carnival. Like, especially if it oh, isn't actually- it's my sisters, Rosa and Dora. I don't like playing with them. They like to tease me and play tricks. They can't be trusted. 
So be careful. I think they even know dark magic. Shouldn't you know that? Ah! Help me! Did his sisters just kidnap hey, him? You there! Over here! Hats! I guess I need to scare them with my flashlight. I'm not even actually sure if that works. I think it just bothers them. Ooh, a grappling hook. I totally have a grappling hook in front of my house. Sullivan Manor. I don't think that batteries that have been grown over by moss would probably be any good. But... Also, usually batteries go in with one plus sign at one end and one plus sign at the other end, but now I'm just being a stickler. What was that? Oh, a letter. Okay. A spooky tree! can't seem to find a foothold. You can't find a foothold to climb up that tree. That tree was designed to climb, dude. A severed arm. Rosa and Dora, Sullivan's property. There's my flashlight switch. Yep, this one had a light bulb. Okay, we need a hammer to get the nails out of that. Oh, we can scare the bats. Fly away, bats. Okay. Place the light spheres so that their rays cover all the bat tiles. Select and drag a sphere to place it on the desired tile. The rays on the sphere indicate the direction which the rays will shine. Okay. okay. Uh, there. No. Okay, you have to be the You have to be there. Or here. Maybe over there. Ah, well, fudge. Okay. So what if you go here? You go there. Nope, there. Hmm. 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 Here. There we go. One more. All right. I mean, one is here. Or at least in this area. One is here. One is there. So, what if I switch you? Yeah. Okay. Over here. Oh, okay, go through that. Okay, go there. All right, that kind of helps. There we go. Got it. My, how you've grown. It's me, Hames, your uncle's butler. Mr. and Mrs. Sullivan have both been acting strangely indeed. Mm hmm. I fear they're being influenced by the monsters sealed under the manor. Oh, you didn't know? Each generation of the Sullivan family guards the seals that prevent the monsters under the manor from getting into our world. It's been the family's sacred duty, but suddenly it seems they want to release the monsters. You must stop them. I'll go find the children. Here, you may need this. I think Hames would be his last name because butlers usually don't they go by their last names? I think. Maybe not. Also, your family are terrible monster hunters. Like, really bad. In each of these games, the thing that's been the problem is that your family... Like, the entire family, yeah. It's all been their fault, whatever it was that happened. Here lies Walter Ward. Why are we trying to exhume him? Oh, I was thinking maybe that would break. Alright, I'm not entirely sure what that's all about. Pretty graveyard. Ouch, I need to protect my hand from the thorns. Yeah, it's probably a good plan. Those look pointy.
Oh look, it's a pile of dirt. This dirt looks freshly dug. I need a shovel to dig it up. Here's the deal, guys. If you have a fresh pile of dirt, it's like a fresh pile of sand. You can just reach your hand in and grab whatever is in there out or brush it one way or the other. Or you know that glove that we just had on our hand? We could use that and we wouldn't even have to get dirty. But no, we have to use a shovel because apparently we're extremely weak. And if anything ever touches our hands, we'll melt like the Wicked Witch of the West. Well, that was easy. No. Oh. We used this hat for exactly the same thing in the first game. <laughs> Who is that exact hat? <laughs> Alright, what is this? A visiting card. Oh, another letter. That's all the letters. And... Screw replacement handle on. Okay, see, the thing is, we're never allowed to use our hand for anything. Sometimes I can see, like, those thorns looked very pointy. Makes sense to have a glove on. But, and, like, if we were digging in the dirt over here by the doll, that is hard, packed dirt. You would need a shovel. You would not be able to get in there without a shovel. This, where was it? The dirt over here, right? This is loose dirt. I could probably kick it over with my shoe. It's ridiculous. And yes, maybe I'm taking this a little too seriously. <sighs> oh, look! The key is stuck in the lock. <laughs> Can I use a handkerchief? Can I use a vending card? No. So, so I have to get a newspaper to stick under the door. And then push the key out, and it will fall on the newspaper, and I can drag it back out again. Silly business. A chain. The Sullivan's Manor keeps a horrible secret. The Sullivan's will take it to their grave so that no one finds out. Why is that printed in a newspaper? It's always newspapers. I actually have had a magazine, but that's pretty close. Can I use the magic wand to poke it out? Yep. There's the key! Locks don't work like this anymore. The only kind of locks that worked like this were locks before, like, the, when you could see through the keyhole. Those are the kind of locks that that work with. Oh, you're finally here. Walter and I were waiting for you. You have such power in your veins. Walter needs you, but no one would mind if I have just a taste of your blood, right? Oh, good job. You started a fire. Ah, uh, that's a problem. Right, bead. Okay. I need a substitute for that. That's a record player. I need to put out the fire! But I'll dust off the pictures first. And... Wow, weird door. I found a potion ingredient. Move, I need to see what's behind there. Good. A. Yeah, I need to put the fire out before it spreads. That would be good. I guess I get to play A. <laughs> Look, it's Foster Sullivan, Victor and Eliza Sullivan, Pierre and Lydia Sullivan, and Rose and Dora Sullivan. So, this is our current aunt and uncle, but turned into vampires. I guess this is they're some one of their parents. All right, let's see. Pie. Ooh, pie sounds good. I just had a whole bunch of candy. I do not need a pie. Pumpkin. I need a kitty cat. Kitty cat. Let's see what's over here. A puppy. And I saw the feather. And a bow tie. 
and a flower. My uh, oldest decided to go as a boss from Kirby's Epic Yarn, Squashini. Hi, Zicky. And Squashini is a um, magician with a pumpkin head. So he was dressed as a magician, but we couldn't find a pumpkin head. So he was just a magician, but really he was Squashini. He just couldn't find the pumpkin head. So now he has a top hat and he thinks that is the coolest thing ever. Ooh, a ring. That's actually something you would want to maybe keep behind a picture in a safe. Okay. Doesn't... Oh, I missed this. Oh, there we go. Okay. I always forget signet rings are supposed to be backwards so they look correct when you impress them. Like, why is everything backwards? There's an empty space in the middle of the shelf. A book must be missing. Oh, cool. What game are you going to play? Where is the rest of that? Why did someone disassemble their fire extinguisher? I don't even think that that's a good idea if you're a vampire. I forget what I need up here. Oh, I need a hammer or something. Okay, I need gears for some reason to lift that. Even though it looks like this... Oh, I guess it's wired to that. Okay, that's fair. But that doesn't help me... Oh, wait, uh, that's not, oh, ooh, the, there's a drawer in here where I can use this. Yep. <laughs> You're not supposed to eat popcorn for dinner. I mean, not just popcorn. Popcorn's not a bad addition to dinner if you're, if it's Halloween, I guess, but... All right, we fixed the fire extinguisher. Reese's pieces are not also not dinner. They could be a <laughs> Come here. I want to play. Hey, don't follow the shadows. They'll deceive you. We didn't want to hurt Foster's feelings. We just wanted to play, but our father took him to the basement. Don't worry. We'll find somewhere to hide. We can take care of ourselves. Okay. I'm trying to figure out what those little girls are dressed up as. They have like Day of the Dead face paint on. It's the seating plan. Okay. Who's that? Oh, okay. Piano. I need something to open the lid. I mean, couldn't you just... That's not generally how that works, but okay. What is this? Oh, it's got skulls. That would work. That would work, too. Lost Lands Dark Overlord. I don't think I played that one. What is this? I need something with a flat edge, like that! Probably could have done that with my fingernails, but you're- Ooh, a skull! And I can grab the metal latch- I can't grab the metal latch with my fingers, so I probably need- Probably push it through with the saw, but whatever. Probably need a magnet for that. What's over here? Ah, this is what I need the saw for. Even though I could probably have pulled that out. A letter opener and a broken record. And a box. Okay. I hate to break it to you guys, but you can't fix a broken record. Once the record's broken, it stays broken. But I guess I can open this with that. 
why wouldn't you break the seal? Oh, wow. Lots of reading. Pierre, I've thought about the sitting arrangement to make sure our guests are comfortable. There are several things to consider. As the master of the house, you'll have the head of the table. I, as your wife, will sit across the table from you. Foster shouldn't sit near Dora or Rosa. He can sit near me in the upper row and the girls near you. Dora and Foster can't sit in the same row. Why? As a ghost, Mr. Cunningham will be cold, so we'll offer him a seat by me near the fireplace? Lady Regina must avoid the moonlight, so she should sit with her back to the window. Eliza and Victor will sit together, but not near Dora. She can be such a nuisance. nuisance. Make sure Victor can talk to a man. Why? Luke the werewolf is the only one who can keep Rosa calm, so they can sit near each other. Elsa invited her friend Mermaid Marnie, Marine. She can sit near Dora. Hopefully she'll behave. Uncle Elliot gets along with everyone, so he can take the remaining seat. Lydia. It, so, so, Walter is the vampire, I think. Pierre is actually our uncle. I'm pretty sure Lydia is actually his wife. So does that mean members of their families are monsters? Oh boy, this should be fun. Okay, so... One of you gets to sit here, where's, and one of you gets to sit there. Walter's the name of an accountant. Wait, which one didn't want to sit by the, the moon? Lady Regina. So you can sit there. Sure. Uh, okay. Uh, da -da 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 -da. he can sit near me in the upper row. Where is him? There he is. And who can't be in the same row as, as row as him? Dora can't sit in the same row, so Rosa gets to sit there, and Dora gets to sit there. Uh, Mr. Cunningham can have a seat near the fireplace. He's a ghost, apparently. Okay. Um, Eliza and Victor will sit together, but not near Dora. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, her back. I don't know how that helps with anything, but whatever. Unless she gets distracted easily. Okay, so the werewolf is going to sit next to Rosa. And Elise is going to, or Mar, Mar, is it, Marine is going to sit there and Uncle Elliot can sit here. I don't know why, and there is a secret compartment with a fork. Why? Why, why, why? It's a very weird house. I still don't know what all that's about. Just need books for this. Finish that. We need to fix the record. Uh, oh, the cork we can use for that, whatever it is in the cemetery. I'm not sure what this is supposed to be. It kind of looks like a weird urn. But it has a magnet and a paintbrush in it. Can I use the paintbrush on the dirt? Nope. Okay. Paintbrush is probably going to be for glue to fix the record, even though there is no way that would work. Wait, why is the dining room on the second story? It's a bit weird. Glue! You can't glue a record back together. Stop. What? Am I missing something? Why can't I? Huh. The record is broken, but I'll glue it together. Good plan. There's the glue. Why can't I use the glue? Right. Well, moving right along. Uh, I guess maybe who knows 
Oh, can I use this to get the nails out? That would only work if it was a very skinny fork and very... Not put in tightly nails. Loose. Loose nails. That was the word I was looking for. Okay. And I got gears so I can lift the coffin up. So I guess the vampire in here can come to dinner with everyone. I'm not entirely sure what I'm doing with this. It's full of flowers! Aww. There's nobody in there that's alive. Or dead, actually. Alright, I need a lily. And that looks like a tiger lily. And a rose. And those kind of look like sweet peas. Yep. Lilies are extremely smelly. I mean... Fragrant, I guess, but also very smelly. Where are... There's one. Where's the last thing of sweet peas? Nope. Oh, there they are. Or, no, you know what? Those are orchids. A rose amulet. That goes on the creepy dolls box. Another lockpick. I had a lockpick already. Why didn't I just keep it? It's not like it's hard to carry. A Walter figure. Okay, well, that didn't help us very much. Uh, let's see. Is there anything else we... Oh, we can unlock this maybe? And I can't use that on that, huh? Okay, we need books still for there. Hmm. And something to dig that up. Oh. Rings. Right. So what are we doing? I have to be over here. Use the skull on the dirt. Yep. That's so dumb. Look, different glue, just like you said. It doesn't matter. Glue will not fix the record. That's like library paste glue. That is definitely not going to help the situation. Because see now, on top of it not being able to stay together because it won't be able to support its own weight... There's now lines of glue where the needle would go. It's like you can't glue a DVD or a CD or a Blu-ray back together either. A book. That's weird. A protractor. That's a protractor. Why do I need a protractor? Didn't realize this game would have geometry. Really? Play the piano and select all the keys. Alright. No, sorry. That's alright. Um, blah, blah, blah. Oh, sorry. Yeah. There we go. A shoe. That doesn't make a lot of sense. The statue makes sense. The shoe, not so much. Yes, you were right about different glue. That's dumb. Oh, look, we found the spider key. I don't know what that's going to help us with, but we'll see. Why does it look like this is missing pieces? Match the outer parts to the inner ones. Select the arrows to rotate the parts and select the part to slide it. Oh! That part. I was trying to click on these. Okay, so you go there. Uh, da -da -da. You there? Yes, yes. Nope. You go there. Wait, get that one over there. Ooh, you go there. You go there. You go there. You go there. I'm just going to go all the way around. Ta-da! The basement. No! It's a trap! 
course it is. Ah, just who I needed. Finally. Innocent blood will release the imprisoned monsters. Even I don't have the power to free them all. But you do. Boy! No matter. Pierre's blood is enough to release some of the monsters <sighs> for now. I'll come back for you. Oh no! It's Walter! The vampire! I read about him in one of my dad's books. He's going to kill my dad! Please, save him! His name is Walter, and our solution to fixing problems in this game seems to be lighting things on fire. And also we had a fire extinguisher just like 10 seconds ago. I was hoping we were going to use that protractor for protracting. I mean, eventually, or originally, he had to be a person. I guess the better question is, who turns a person named Walter into a vampire? If I saw through this horn, I might be able to use it later. Okay. What is this? This brassiere should be lit. Okay. Bet I didn't just have fire. I wonder if you're allowed to change your name as a vampire. Something's stuck in the mechanism. I'll try to knock it out with a boot. No. Lockpick. Bone. Sharp horn. Oh. I think you were supposed to knock the stone out, not the whole mechanism. I mean, I guess. It just seems like something... A weird house. <gasps> Look, a mimic! There was a mimic in the set last book! I found, by the way, and I have to share it here because it's awesome, uh, the Funko Pop people have made some Dungeons & Dragons figures, and one of the things they made was a mimic, but it's not a chest shape. It's shaped like a Funko Pop box. So the whole thing is the mimic, and then it's got its mouth open and it's trying to eat you, and it's adorable. Apparently, it's hungry. What is that? No, potion ingredients again, okay. There's a key in there too, huh? Those are some ugly pants, my goodness. It's regulated by a lever. It's a closet. How is that regulated? Can use a bone? No? All right. What is this? A circus pendulum. Is this like for a hamster? Luggage is adorable. That would be from Discworld. Why don't we use the saw that we used in the very last scene instead of having to look for an axe? Bats. I need to find something sticky first. Like glue! Uh-huh. Bone? I don't get that. That is a gargoyle door stopper. There should be another candle. Actually, I think that's supposed to be a vampire and a werewolf. Right. What is this? A toy acrobat. Oh, is that for this? Yes, okay, that makes more sense than a hamster. Okay, uh, so we have a bone and two, oh wait, duh. These go in there. There's the other acrobat. What is that, a jack? Yep. And I should fix the generator and fill it with fuel. Why? Why do I need to do that? Unless I'm going to use an electric chainsaw to cut through that, which is dumb because I just had an actual saw over here. Now let's put him over here. 
Oh, he must go in there. <laughs> the hamster euthanasia roller coaster. What is wrong with you? <laughs> Oh my gosh. All right. Uh, oh, what's this? Oh, I guess I can't get in there. Oh, there's some bats down here. Monsters from Pierre's closet. Okay. Uh, wait, can't I go back? Apparently I can't go back. I am now stuck here. Huh. I'm using that on him? That doesn't sound like a good idea. Can't go back. See, cause Halloween. Ha 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 ha. You're so funny. Alright. Crossbow. What else do we need? Garlic. Flashlight. Brass knuckles. I don't think you normally use brass knuckles to fight monsters, but sure. Musket net. Wait. Oh. Okay. Oh. That was blue, though, wasn't it? What's this? Ah, uh, bandolier, herbicide, chain mace, bulletproof vest. Wait, I wanted to see what all the other things were. Boy, I feel gypped. Okay, trap. Uh, chain mace. Oh. That's actually, I think, a flail. But that's fine. A bulletproof vest. I should stitch it up. I don't think you can stitch up a bulletproof vest. I think it's immune to bullets. So it would be very hard to stitch up. Boy, whoever is in charge of this mimic is really messy. An axe! Are we gonna un vice the or jack the poor mimic? No? Seems kinda mean. I mean, I think I could. Or, well, you might. Wait, please don't be afraid. I'm sorry I attacked you. Walter turned me into a vampire, and the bloodthirst clouded my mind. I can't live like this. Pierre hid some of the cure in the garden. Please, find it for me. Here, you might need this. Aw, she's a nice vampire. Shut up, bird. Thank you. A fire hydrant with a really tiny hose. Wish I had something sharp to cut them. I do! Why does... An unusual tool. That's a wrench. You need a wrench. What is this? Incomplete pump. I guess I need these things for that. Another potion ingredient. <laughs> the strangest of tools. I need to find a handle. How about a bone? No? Alright. I guess I can't get that till I lower the bridge. Oh, this is cool. Aw, oh, froggy! The <laughs> bridge is the forbidden hammer. What is wrong with you two? I bet I can file some of this moss away. I bet I could just pull the thing off with my fingers! Oh, it's already over there. Alright, so we need to cure... I'm full of soda and candy. I'm full of candy. Wait, was there, there was something else in the background there, wasn't there? Oh, I guess that's down the river. Okay. All right. We have a pump, which I assume we need that little piece of hose for. We have a bone, which I am not entirely sure what we're going to use for. We need another hamster wheel. We need a candle. Another lever, which we can't use the bone for. Uh, this needs all kinds of weird stuff to fix. Where are we supposed to be? Over here. 
Right. So what are we supposed to do over here? I need another one of those. Oh, look, I bet it's a bone. That I used the bone for? People are ridiculous. Wait, what else do I need in this picture? Oh. Ring. Now I have a hose. Are we happy? Good. I mean, the water wasn't that deep. I probably could have just reached it. Hey, that tree turned into a dude. Why did the tree turn into a dude? Ah, okay. Place tokens in the correct tiles so the number equals 94. Why is there so much math in these games? All right. Thirty. Fifty. Put down. Thank you. Fifty. Need forty something or other. Well, that's not going to work. You lose, please try again. Am I missing something or do none of those numbers add up to 94? How does that up to 50? How does that do, what? They do? I mean, not three of them though. How did that add up to 50? Seventy-four. Why did that one... I don't get it. Oh, look, anti-vampire medicine. I can't math, I have a dumb. <laughs> Thank you. I'll get Foster somewhere safe and look for my girls. You should find and read Pierre's book on Eldritch Matters. Ooh, Eldritch. It explains how to prevent Walter's plan and keep the monsters out of our world. Take this, and good luck. But my question is, were you dressed that li like that before you turned into a vampire? A lighter! I don't remember why I needed that. Can I use the rock? No. Where did I need a lighter? Oh, uh, the brazier, which is over here. Why did that make the cow skull's eyes glow? Or the bricks explode? You know, either of those things. Okay. Oh my gosh, that would make me dizzy. I bet that's a real act somewhere, too. Yikes. Hey, this box looks really familiar. This is from the first game, I think. Except instead of flat tiles like that, they were stamps. Okay, we need bats for that. Everything else is done down here. Where do we need... Oh, wait. Show available action. Oh! Okay, I was in the wrong place. Ah, this is the lever for the closet for some reason. Ooh, a secret passageway. Oh, this is a cool room. Well, he looks friendly. Okay. Um, what is that? Moth wing. Sure, why not? A bat! This retro TV needs its game pad? Is that supposed to be like a PlayStation? 
Maybe? It's locked. I'll just have to break the glass. Oh, I'm so glad you decided that. Thank you. I don't know why we can't break all the glass. This is like an emergency. It's dirty. I'll have to wipe it clean. Doesn't it say 1597? Can I use the flowers? No, that's dumb. Okay. What's over here? Ooh, we get to make a potion. Okay, we need the pink flowers. And moth wings. Oh. Moth wings. Wait. Oh, I thought I had to put all the stuff in the picture first. And pink flower. Guess I have to light this on fire. Ah, sure. One, two, let's see. One, two, three. Okay, so I put the flower and the moth wings into this jar. No? Oh, okay. And also some water. Why are we making a potion? I wasn't paying attention. And I guess I have to stir it. Oh, there's a spoon. Now in this game, making a potion makes sense. As opposed to finding a potion recipe in the basement of a hospital in the last game. Are we making a tart for a tart burner? Or a moon cake. Kind of looks like a moon cake. Fertilizer. That's not what I was expecting. <laughs> What's a tart burner? Here, have a cookie. I guess the mean plant just wanted a cookie. It's fair. I want a cookie. I always want a cookie, even when I've had too much Halloween candy. It's a flaw, I know. All right, bats. All right, let's see what this is. I studied magic since childhood. My head filled with images of wizards and unicorns. Reality ended up a bit more ordinary than that, but my abilities saved my home. Okay. I studied magic. Okay. Green? No. Oh, studied. <laughs> Since my childhood, my head was unicorns. That's actually a unicorn pegasus, but whatever. Saved my home. Weapons like guns and alicorn. Knives can't Thank stop you. Vampires, werewolves, and golems. But I found a way to defeat them. I chained them in my basement. Oh, you are way too happy saying that. That is all kinds of creepy, sir. However, even monsters have their admirers. People try to open their cages to free them, so I racked my brain to find a solution. Even their admirers? Oh. Monsters learned to avoid my traps, and arrows couldn't pierce them, so I created a magical barrier that only a drop of human blood could break. That seems like something that's very easy to get a hold of, though. I would think you'd want to make it something much more hard to find than that. Yeah, Uncle, Uncle's got a couple screw lo screws loose. Also, it looks like Auntie actually does dress like that all the time. Oh, that's a creepy. A monster. All right, I'll chain it at once. Uh-huh, how am I going to do that? 
I have a fishing rod and a pipe. A pipe? That's not a pipe. That's a horn. And an awl. I could stab it with the awl. But it wouldn't like that. Nope. That's not what we're doing. Yes, we do get a lot of awls in these games. Oh my gosh. Erdite, really? That, that chain's not locked. Did we just get another awl? Why? Why did we get another awl? Why did we- We just have one! I did. I did both of those things because I love him. But his puns are terrible and we just got another awl, so I'm more concerned about that at the moment. Also, that chain is not locked. It is just rung around that. I know the game heard you. Thank you. Do you know what? I heard you through the floor again, laughing, because you think this is funny. <sighs> okay, we're going to file the moss off Stump Dude's head. And nothing happened. He just turned into a dude, and that has no bearing on anything. Good to know. And now we have a fishing rod. Is that a boot with a button in the foot? Can I use that? No. Can I use that? Why did we get a second all? Why didn't we just keep the first all? Especially if we just got them right after each other. Like, it's not even like it was, like, way into the game. Boy, this game does- these games do not trust us with any type of fuel. I mean, maybe you should get a second all. Y you can't be too careful, I guess. I have no idea. Shouldn't- Okay. A rusty saw and a blanket? Rag. A broken saw. I mean, that was rusty, not broken. It does need a new blade, though. I will give you that. Okay, we got the stuff here. What is... Oh, we need something to wash this off. Alright, I would have missed the last letter. Number, rather. One, five, nine... Seven, three. A fake-ass Nintendo controller. What is this nonsense? Hit all the one-eyed monsters. Select a creature when it appears to hit it. Your score is shown on the left. You lose points for each correct, incorrect creature you hit. Okay, so I can only hit the ones with one eye. This is really weird. Here's that moldy uh, yeti again, or whatever he is. This game is so weird. Cyclops werewolf, that one's new. I mean, you're not wrong. Right, where was the thing I needed? Oh, the bridge. Forest trail. What is all this nonsense? Dude, I, I really don't think you need the loincloth. Why, why do I need to get to the city? I missed that. Oh, yeah, I released some of the monsters. But why are... Like... Wait, what? Maybe I can pick... That's an all, not a lockpick. I guess I need a second all. Or a third one, I guess. I don't know. Cat. Okay, that kitty is angry. Good to know. Angry kitties are not fun to play with. Pruners. 
Why do I need pruners? A stick! Right. Okay. I need food for the kitty. Sullivan Circus. Okay. Oh, a saw blade. How convenient. I've prepared another number, and you'll love it. I promise we'll do it without magic this time. Well, almost. Here. He drew a picture of a blank piece of paper on his note. Was that to make sure everyone knew it was a note? Specific shape goes here. Oh, look, the magic hat. Magic dust. All right, what's this? I hope they find the key. I mean, that's always a good idea. Oh no, the clown is angry. Will you let me pass for a coin? Greedy little clown. Jeez. Okay, find the missing items from the photos. A barbell, a ribbon, and a feather. Let's see. A barbell, bell, a ribbon, and a feather. Yep, okay, got that one. Uh, let's see, a shoe, a juggling stick, and his coat juggling stick. I think those are called something, but I forget what. There's his coat. Did I find the shoe already? No, there's a shoe. Alright. Uh, let's see. And a platform, a whip, and a hoop on fire. Or not on fire, I guess. Platform is right in the front. Ah, oh, that's much better. And there's the whip. Oh, look at the cute spider goblin. That's adorable. Magic hat, snake charmer's flute, and a tutu. Tutu. Uh, magic hat. And where is the snake charmer's flute? There it is. Devil sticks? Maybe. Ha 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 ha. You have one of those stupid things, don't you? That The devil sticks, they're not... The, the ones that are just the stick, where you use two sticks to twirl a third stick. You totally have those, don't you? No, not you, Erdite. Those are the devil sticks. I don't know what the juggling... Juggling pins. Aren't they called juggling pins? Look where we would be to saw it completely off. I mean, agreed. Can I keep the saw? Oh, yeah, it does need a screw. You don't screw them on, it ends poorly. I mean, he is the stoner dude from college, except he never did any drugs that I know about. So he was the straight edge stoner dude from college. Wait, we're doing another one of these puzzles? This is the same puzzle in the same... This isn't even the extra game. Okay, now I have rope. What is this for? A horse emblem. Oh, that goes over here. And that is what? A cable. And rods. Okay. And a handkerchief of magic dust. That is for the hat. Well, actually, I guess I don't know how magic hats work. I always thought you needed a wand. Ooh, a bird. What's this? Some strings are missing. Okay. Nope, can't use that to pick the lock. I need something for that. Alright, let's see what else is outside. It's an evil skeleton. Bad to the bone, I'll just have to shoot you away. I'm sorry, but generally speaking, shooting a skeleton is not the best way to go about getting rid of one. There, There's hardly anything to hit. 
I'm not going to feed that pigeon to the cat, am I? No, good. Okay. Oh, there's some more stuff over here. Oh, the pigeon is going to help us get... There is a flashlight attached to a belt and a crossbow on this tree. And the pigeon is going to knock it down for us. Thank you, pigeon. That was weird. Too dark in there for me. I bet, I bet the flashlight needs batteries. And, oh wait, does it need a light bulb too? Okay, maybe just a battery. Still. A crossbow. It is super hard to hit a skeleton with a crossbow, even at close range. My loyal monsters, your years of imprisonment are over. And to celebrate, I've brought you a gift. Your friend and mine, <laughs> the one and only Pierre Sullivan. Yet some are still missing from our ranks. Guard Sullivan while I search for the rest of his family. Where do all these movies and video games get these giant steel cages? I don't think I've ever seen one in real life. I wonder what's at the bottom of this. Probably something I need for the game. Werewolf boyfriend. I don't think you want this particular werewolf to be your boyfriend. Okay, we need some tape for that. Need a corkscrew for that. You're sure you can make it work? Okay. We need a key for this. Visit a unique town destruction show? They made a poster for this? Okay. Some darts are missing. Oh, okay. That's fine. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Maybe I can miss, mix this into a potion later. Oh no, that, I'm trying to click on this. He needs my help fast. Generally speaking, yes. Okay. Then there's something I can do over here, huh? Nothing will work unless I restore electricity. That makes sense. Wait, what did I just do? Oops, I went the wrong way. I need a battery. And I need to start the motorcycle. I need something to open this. I have two rods. I don't know what I do with those. I need tape. This is really where I'm supposed to be. Yeah, I can't go any farther back. Okay. I must be missing something. Yeah, I wanted to see if I could figure it out, but I guess not. Over here. Oh. That dart's electrified. I should use some tools to pick it up. Why is the dart electrified? What's it touching? This isn't plugged in! That's one of the problems I have at the moment. How is it electrified? That can't be electrified. It's not on or connected to electricity. It's near electricity. It wasn't really. <sighs> okay. Place the balloons in the correct slots. Select and drag balloons to move them. The number indicates how many balloons belong in that row. When a row has the correct number of balloons, its number turns green. I thought I was going to be shooting darts at things. All right, one goes here. Let's see. Let's see. One goes near. Okay. Oh. Cool. That was a good shot. All of them at the same time. 
A UV flashlight. Can I steal the batteries out of here? Probably not. Okay, uh, how did that help me? What do I need a UV flashlight for? Can I shine it in there? No. Oh, maybe to see the fingerprints? I mean, that kind of helps, I guess. Oh, is it supposed to be from darkest to lightest? Sure, why not? A counting book. Oh, was Uncle cooking the books too? I can't find the right stone to, repl to repel monsters. We need to get at least one of them soon. That looks like a like a a speed gun that cops have, except with a gem inside of it. It's a little weird. Now, what is that? Oh, that's one of the strings. And this is a key. What do I need that's locked? Oh, over here. Electrical tape. Don't know why you'd lock that up, but sure. It is not the proper use for an accounting book. But maybe he figured if you said accounting book, no one would ever look to see. That plug just had lugged into a plug that only had one dot in the center. And it had two dots. And this plug is sideways. So unless this has four dots, that did not work. Also, what is all this weird stuff inside the... What is this anyway? Oh, okay. It's more like a spotlight. Happy Halloween! Hey, what's up? Did you eat too much candy? I ate too much candy. Erdite ate too much candy, too. And Aut Punk, actually. All of us... All of us ate too much candy. All right. <laughs> you did not yet? Dude. Dude. It's 10.15. You, you ate too much candy. You did. Dude, if you didn't eat enough candy yet to have eaten too much, you probably shouldn't eat too much tonight. Candy time. <laughs> Okay. Did that work? Eat more. Eat more. No, you're supposed to eat too much on Halloween night and then do stupid stuff, probably. Actually, when we were growing up, we would play poker for Halloween candy is what we would do. But yeah, no, we'd organize all of our candy into piles and then we would make a wall with the candy. And then we would play poker. Why do I have a ninja star? That's interesting. Oh. Wasn't even trying for that. E Garfield Heat. <laughs> That's the one I didn't watch tonight. I watched Snoopy and I watched that weird one where the witch turns the kids into monsters. But I didn't watch uh, Garfield's Halloween. Oh, good. Now you're both going to sing. That's great. It's a shame that uh, you all are not also on voice chat. So we are depriving the universe of your singing. Can you tell how upset I am about it? <laughs> Where is that mushroom? Why do I not see that mushroom? I can crack this nut. Okay. Oh, and I need to get a candy. Oh, there it is. Okay. It's a bonbon type candy. I do not see the mushroom. What am I going to crack that with? What do I got here? A rock. Oh my gosh. They're still singing. Ay, ay, ay. All right. Where's the mushroom? Mushroom. Mushroom. For a minute, I thought it was, that was the umbrella, but nope, that's just an umbrella. Okay, I can't see it. Why can't I see it? Oh my gosh, it's right in front of me, too. That's great. Who, Erdite? I don't think he's thought of that yet, but I'm kind of surprised that 
no one has done that. Kitty food for the kitty! And now we have a corkscrew. Oh, for the bottle. Okay, that actually makes sense. Pop! That wasn't a great pop. I have a disappoint. Ah, it's a skeleton! There's another thing in this picture, and I don't see it. Ah, there it is. Alright, where was the thing with the cork? Yeah, he's not as good at random as uh, the rest of us. Unlocked occasions, you are here. Oh, here we go. That was over here. We're doing a lot of the same puzzles over and over again in this game. Nails, a rake. Okay. All right, let's see. Pretzel. No? Wait. Oh, 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 okay. And then there's the whirly gig. And the eyeball one. And the twirly do. And the eggy. And the basket. Greebles, huh? I will put that in. Is that a robot name? That should be a robot name. The robots in Aunt Punk's book that she's working on. Thank you for saving me. This is bad. Walter freed most of the monsters. We must perform the sealing ritual before sunrise to contain them again. Please find Rosa and Dora before Walter does. They might be in the caves nearby. I'll look for a way to perform the ritual. Here, take my motorcycle. Still not a motorcycle, guys. That is still not a motorcycle. That is a Vespa. Um, yes, or a moped. Yep. The, uh, yeah, Op Punk is writing a series and all of her robots... Well, most of her robots are named after odd right on shooting star. Lord Walter says nobody can enter. Okay. I am going to finish this sentence. Odd Punk's robots are named after weird words that are actually things in real life. Like sprue and greeble and what else? You've got a whole bunch. There is a lot of moss on top of stuff in this game. Aglet? Yep. That was a good one. I like aglet. It'd be easier if I just burn through these thick vines. Yeah, that probably won't hurt anyone who happens to be inside the cave. Good plan. What is this? I could just kick it. I probably should just kick it. We use fire a lot in this game. And you know, like, half the time is on accident? Which is probably not great. Oh, wait. Close. That's yarn. That's not thread. That is 100% yarn. Thread is th way thinner than that. Also, I'm pretty sure I could walk up those with them out, with them not being nailed down. I would just have to go very carefully. That's all. A stick. Yep, that is a stick. Oh, wow, and an arrow and a hammer. Wait, where did I need a hammer? I don't remember. I guess I need it right here. Or the stairs. I, I might be getting tired. Oh, 
what is this nonsense? Whoa, collect green power spheres to fill the scale on the left. Move your ring over a green sphere, then press to collect. Oh, well, that's easy. Wait. Ah, it was just a sheet that scared me. Wait, isn't that a real ghost over there? Are you serious? What do you seek in this abandoned place? Are you looking for the twins? This place is dangerous. I wanted to warn them, but I knew a ghost would only scare them. I wish I'd gone to the underworld. Could you help me? Here, you'll need this. I can't believe that was a thing that just happened. Oh no, blood! Gross! I don't think that was blood. That did not look like blood. Bandages? Oh, and I need two more of those things. It's missing the handle. Oil. Oh, that's the lantern handle. Okay. You need something to get that out of the crack. I need to light it. Well, I need to open it before I can light it. Also, I'm pretty sure that I could light it in that fire that's out there. But I bet you won't let me. Good, that's how you actually sort of make a torch. Uh, a lot of these games, they just have you like put a stick in a fire and that is not how you make a torch. <laughs> then you just have a stick that's lit on fire and they don't actually burn as well as you would think or as evenly. Why didn't that work? Why can't I light the lantern on fire with the torch. <sighs> oh, sure, I can light that on fire. No, please don't hurt me. I'll tell you everything you want to know about Walter's plans. Not this time, little girl. Oh no, the witch stole the pumpkin. I bet he's gonna be pie soon. Too bad. This is also not a cave. I mean, technically it's a cave, but I guess I need another barrel. And a wrench to get the shovel out. What is that? I could knock down this barrel. With the arrow. With the arrow? Oh. I shouldn't forget about rope. Why do I need a rope around the arrow? I thought I was just going to knock it down. Oh, it's attached to something. I did not realize that. How did I pull it down if it was attached to something? Pie. I don't actually like pumpkin pie that much. I'm more of a um, fruit pie person myself. I definitely need something to paddle that with. Ah, like a paddle. What is that? Okay, let's go across the river. Or lake, or whatever this is. I have never tried sweet potato pie. That's a weird noise. Is that supposed to be the ants? Okay, glue. So there's a pin. Open it with something sharp, like a pin. That would be a way to do that. Can I use the pin to get that? Nope. Can I use the pin to clean out that? Nope. I should attach this. Wish I had something long. Oh, backpack. Screwdriver. 
on this weird box that's screwed closed that has the magnet in it. Sure, why not? Why do I need a magnet? Wait, is this... Nope. Glue. Oh, can I use it to get this? Yes, that would work. I don't know why I couldn't have used the pin to open the sugar container. Those sugar cubes look like Tetris pieces. <laughs> Oh, I was hoping they would go away, and I wouldn't have to hear that weird noise anymore. Ta-da! I don't want any of that stuff, huh? All right. That is the handle for an axe. Ah, here we go. And I guess I'm using it to cut this branch. Which I am then going to use to get the paintbrush. Wow, that branch was a lot bigger than it looked. And then I'm going to put glue on it. And now I have a paintbrush with glue. I should attach this to what? What is it even? A crank? Oh, okay. I mean, you could probably still use it without the handle, but... I suppose that would make it easier. Though I'm pretty sure with these things, the handle part is supposed to spin. So, like, it's not supposed to actually be glued to the rest of the handle. Huh. What is this? Yeah, it's fair, I guess. I have a bucket. Can I get water? Nope. Of course not. I have a chisel. And a lantern that I can't light, even though I have fire. I guess this is to uncover the gravel? Nope. Chisel. What do you chisel for? Oh, maybe to get this? Yeah, that works. I forget what those spirals are called. There's one that's three rabbits. Um that appears in Celtic art, and they actually don't know what it means, which is pretty cool. Oh, look, we need another battery. What happened to all the flashlights we've had in this game? Do we just throw them away when we're done with them? Also, if I can use matches to light this, I could have used the torch too. It means bunnies are cool. I mean, bunnies are pretty cool. I can't argue with that. And I'm not using the bucket on this, huh? All right. What do I need a lantern for? Oh, what's this? It's a bat. That's a fruit bat. He's cute. They're sky puppies. And that is a socket wrench, which we can use to get this shovel out. I don't know why you would bolt a shovel to the wall, but whatever. Now we can dig through the gravel. Gravel is something that you shouldn't use your hands for. That would hurt your hands almost every time. That makes sense to have a shovel. A syringe and a video camera. I'm not entirely sure what these things are for. Why does it seem like it should be able to move these, though? I should read the directions. Rotate the dials so they or their shadows form the silhouettes shown in the center. Select a dial to rotate it. Rotating one dial may move others. Okay. All right. So this, the shadow doesn't make the right design, but that does. Okay, so that one's done. Oh, that was three dots to do that, yeah. Okay. Paint that All right. Wait, that's right. There we go. And then the moon goes that way. Where are you? Where are you going? Where's the answer supposed to work? All right. I'm tired of that. Ooh, that looks sparkly. Magic amulet. Is this to give to the dude? I forget what he was looking for. Thank you. 
I guess we killed him. Good for us. Alright, do we need to do anything else in here? I think we are done in here. Now this goes over here. Use the center stone to move the tiles into their matching colored slots. Press the arrow to rotate the center stone. Select a tile to move it in and out of the center. Tiles light up when placed correctly. Ta-da! A grappling hook. Sure, why not? Why do I need a grappling hook? Get up there? Why do I want to go up there? Our second one, you're right! Oh my gosh, I forgot. It's a witch! What will this potion do? This brew can amplify Lord Walter's sense of smell to hunt down the Sullivans by their blood alone. Yes! How oh, brilliant! And one of the ingredients is pumpkin! Mwahaha! There's a bear back there. It's probably not good. Okay. And over here we have a blow-up boat that is not blown up. Okay. Ah. Uh... And a cannon just chilling in the swamp. There's something in the water. I'll have to get it, but heaven forbid I use my hands. Night vision lens for the camera. Okay. I mean, that's technically a thing, though I don't think it would work once it's been in the swamp water for any length of time. I'll shoot something in the woods with this and the monsters will go away. How do you know that? Really, Hot Punk? Really, you two? Oh, wow. Lots of aminals in the swamp. Deer, lantern, owl boot, noose, frog. There's multiple nooses in the uh, forest, huh? That, that's bad, generally speaking. Owl. Oh, look, a capybara. And a lizard, and a snail, and a boar, and a chipmunk. I forgot what I was looking for already. Oh, that's cool. That's with the uh, night vision on. Look, banshees. Ah, uh, what am I doing? Noose. There's another noose. That's not creepy at all. There's a hare. And a beaver. I am losing my focus here. Ooh, these are heat ones. Aw, he's so cute. He's a weasel. Weasels are adorable. I understand that they're annoying, and that's why we, like, call them out as being weasels. But at the same time, they're so cute. There's another owl, there's a hedgehog, and a mole, and a pheasant, a boot, a frog, and a lantern. I don't think any of those things are over here. Nope. A boot, a frog, and a lantern. I don't think capybaras live in this environment. I think they live farther south, like where it's warmer. The frog. There's an air pump just chilling next to the bear, huh? Sure, why not? Do you know how long it would take to blow up a boat like that? with one of those pumps. 
Oh, look, we're on a farm now. There's oil in here. I wish I had something to collect it with. I do. I have a syringe. I don't know why, but I do. And we need... I need to cover it with something. Or you need, like, bolt cutters. There's no candy. Do not disturb. Dude. My sister and her family and my parents totally wussed out and did not give out Halloween candy this year. Bunch of Halloween Scrooges. Oh, that's another one I didn't watch. I didn't watch um, The Grinch's Halloween, which that is not what it's called, I'm pretty sure. Grinch Night. That's what it's called. That is a really cool Halloween thing. I can use anything sharp to cut this cover. That's sharp? You just said I could use anything sharp. I can use anything sharp. Pointy sharp. You poop head. Garlic. Why did they nail down the blanket? I mean, that kind of makes sense. Because then it won't fly away in the wind. It's kind of a cool scarecrow, actually. Can you use that? No. I bet I could have used that fork. I need a map. Okay. Sure. What is this? A blanket, garlic, a wrench, and three nuts. What am I supposed to be doing now? Well, whatever it is, it's over here. Oh, I'm supposed to use the blanket on the barbed wire. That would technically work. It would still be hard to get over the fence, though. That is our second two-prong fork. This game is using the same things over and over again a lot. What is this? Pumpkin bomb. Pumpkin bomb instructions. Components. Flammable liquid. I assume the other one was a pumpkin. Pour liquid into pumpkin. Cover the lid. That's it? That's the whole thing? Don't you have to light it? Those vile kids got me. Next Halloween, I'll give them an unforgettable fireworks display so they don't come within a mile of my farm. Dude, this farmer was going to throw a bomb at the trick-or-treaters. It, yes, it would work. Farmers probably shouldn't be throwing bombs at the trick-or-treaters. Yeah. All right. Oh, what's over here? This looks like a... What? That was weird. Use the valves on the left to move the sensor arrow into the green. Okay. What is that supposed to be? Flammable liquid. What the heck is the farmer doing here? Something's in the bag. What if I try to reach it with something longer? Like a broom? Yeah, that's only part of the broom. Okay. Ah, uh, sure. Why do I need a pumpkin bomb? Okay, sure, whatever. Wait, didn't I need to brush something off? I think I need to brush something off. Oh. Still think you would need to light it. Why didn't we just shoot it at the witch? Yeah, except with a Molotov cocktail, you're supposed to have a piece of cloth or something sticking out of the top, which you light and then throw. It's not just going to catch fire if you throw it. It's just going to get 
flammable liquid everywhere. Ooh, look, a frog. Bye, frog. Magnet. I think Walter will love this brew if it has some garlic in it. Dude, that's not cool. Is everything prepared? Yes, master. No living soul will escape from you now. You would dare try to poison me? You'll both regret this. Wow. He totally lit the witch and the pumpkin on fire. More fire. I need to put out this fire before it spreads. How the heck am I going to do that? Well, I mean, they weren't really people. Okay, so I'm going to knock the water tower down to put the fire out. Why don't I just call the fire department? What do we have against the fire department in these games? Why do we need a magnet? Or a broom. Can I use that? What is it? A fish hook. Can I use the fish hook to cut this open? Of course not. That's not sharp either. Heaven forbid. To get a lobster. No. That's silly business. Ew. Okay. That's what I need to broom. Look, it's the hat again! That's the exact same hat. This is not even the bonus episode. This is the same game. This is just lazy at this point. I mean, I understand moving, using the same asset from game to game, or even in the main game and then the bonus chapter, but really, guys. If you can't figure out how to make a... Um, saw this down, the water will put out the fire. Yeah, it's not generally a great idea. It... If you can't figure out different puzzles for different parts of the same part of the game, then I think you have a problem. Yeah, totally could have done that with any of the sharp objects. Look, it's a greenhouse. Okay. Wait. Oh, okay, got it. Um... Oh, I thought I'd need to put them all in pots, but I don't. I just need to put them near them. Oh, that's what's it called. Isn't that the devil's fingers or something? That's a mushroom, not a plant. I don't think it grows on a stalk either. What just happened? Dang, nabbit. I forget what those are called. Those are cool. They're hydrangeas. This is a very weird collection of flowers this person has growing here. I think those are monkey orchids. Oh, I forget what those are called. Those are weird flowers. They look like Dr. Seuss plants. No, nope, that's the monkey orchid. I did not expect that to be there. A treasure map! Cool beans. I like treasure. Okay. What just happened? That just seems like we skipped a puzzle completely. Like they got bored and decided not to do that one. Ugh, another lock. Can I use a fish hook? No. All right. Also, let's just take a look at this for a moment. This water tower appears to be being held up with two telephone poles. It must be having issues. It's probably not the best way to do it, but whatever. I think I am going to cut down this one. If I cut down this pole, do you know where that water tower is going to go? Away from the fire. If I want it to fall that way, I need to probably cut down this pole, which is made of metal. Or at least this pole, and then it would kind of fall sideways, and then maybe the water would go that way. Let's see if I'm right. 
Yep. Oh, no, I'm going to cut down both of them on this side. Oh my gosh, that's not how physics works, guys. It, ugh, it's not how physics works. Okay, I put out the fires. Everyone how Who's Rosetta? Who is this? He doesn't look aggressive, but I still don't want to get caught in a whirlwind. whirlwind. Oh, it's a golem. I think. Or a djinn? It kind of looks like a cross between a golem and a djinn. Some sort of sand elemental. Oh, it's a pupper! Hey, puppy! What, you want a hat? You would have a hat. You would look adorable in that hat. Dude. You want a hat? Oh my gosh, you wanted a hat. I was kidding. That's not even a pirate hat. From. Yeah, I said! Like, they are literally reusing the exact assets. I mean, they are good assets, but you can open it with something hooked. It's actually a lot harder to do than you think it is, and modern cars don't have that. Glove compartment is locked. I need to wedge it, wedge it open with something. Okay. That clown was also in the last game. Also in a box like this, I think. More needle and thread. Another door knocker. Guys are getting lazy. I so want a house with a knocker like that. Wouldn't that be cool? Hello, I'm Pierre's old friend, Rosetta. Don't worry, Rosa and Dora are safe. They're playing in their room. Did you see the dust monster? It came out of my garbage can and started destroying my garden. Could you help me deal with it before you talk to the girls, please? I once saw Pierre <laughs> defeat a dust monster with a vacuum cleaner. <laughs> Here, in case you get thirsty. <laughs> what happened here? Oh my gosh! That'll agree with. That needs to be cleaned up. Those girls... Uh, yeah, no, that makes sense too, actually. Okay, ma'am. <laughs> what? Let's go... Another hairdryer! That was from the first game, too. What is this? This is the vacuum cleaner. Dust pocket needs mending? Sure. Okay. Home. Are they dead? Show me your invitation. Okay. You're gonna make me fill up the cup with water and then... Yeah. That's dumb. That's extremely dumb. Man, I want some of that candy. Candy apples. See, those are the pumpkins I was talking about. I haven't had any of them this year. Cupcake. I want some of those pumpkins. To find a replacement handle. All right. What is this? Wet invitation. Oh, I need to dry off the invitation. All right. Why is the girl dead? Correctly fill the board with symbols without repeating them in any row or column. Okay. Wait, the sound stopped. That was weird. Oops, that's it. That was easy. What did I just open? Oh. We are so glad you're alive. We found our dad's notes about the sealing ritual while we were playing. But we can't focus on it with the dust monster outside.
Can you defeat it? Here. This is for you. Aw, scissors. How nice. Can I have some of your candy? No? Okay. Boy, there sure is a lot of things embedded in other things in this game, too. Never guess the code without a clue. Oh, that was pretty cool. Look! Look, look, look! What do you think we're going to use this time? Let me see if I can remember. We had a skateboard, a roller skate, a rolling pin. I think I'm missing one. I don't know what the other one was. I think we're missing another one. I wonder if we actually have a wheel this time. What is that? Dang, I can't remember what the fourth one was. It wasn't a wheel. Teddy bears. Oh, that's cool. How did they manage to put that inside the doll's house? What is it? You're going to saw open their dollhouse? That's real nice, dude. All right, we got that. We have a little trident, a paper clip. I think I need that, but I don't actually have a bag. Oh wait, can I use the trident to open the toolbox? Paper clip. Yep. We have picked like 18 locks in this game and we keep getting rid of the things we're using to pick the locks with. And we're totally going to saw into the kid's dollhouse. Wow, that's not cool, dude. I guess there's something inside the tunnel, but where's the train? I wonder if the train will look like Thomas the Tank Engine this time. Okay, now we got the clock hands. Why does she have this in her house? A teddy bear! And what is this? Oh, that's the bag for the vacuum cleaner. Wow, I can't remember the last time I had a vacuum cleaner with a bag. In some ways that was convenient, but in some ways not so convenient. Wait, can I use this to open that? Oh, okay. Let's go suck up the dust monster in the vacuum cleaner! It. I see Pierre's gifts run in the family. Thank you for stopping that monster. Pretty sure it was the vacuum cleaner. We found this place where one can seal away the monsters. Dad is probably there already, but he can't do it without your help. I can take care of the girls, but Pierre needs you. You can take my car. I lost the key, but I'm sure you'll figure something out. I have a strange feeling that this might help. A bone for the doggy. Okay, sure. Knick knack paddywhack, give the dog a bone. And this old man came rolling home. Okay. Oh, we still need to... Oh, can I use this to open up the... Wow, that was a lot bigger of a trident than I thought it was. What's the paper? Code. Oh, I need the key. Yeah, why didn't you give me the key, lady? That would have been a lot more helpful. Machete handle. Is there a machete in their toy box? Wow, this is a very full toy box. Okay, uh, hat, box, ball, ball, dress, jeans, or overalls, no, that, thank you, hay bear, harlequin, feather, Curly red hair. 
brocade. Oh, that's that looked pinker down here. And where's the curly red hair? Whoops, I'm whistling. No whistling. Probably very loud and obnoxious. Where's the hair? Oh. Okay. I'm not blind. Wow, that is a very creepy jack in the box. And it doesn't look like Thomas the Tank Engine this time. That is a doorknob. All right, I don't have a code for that. Okay. <laughs> yep. Non-Thomas the Tank Engine this time. What else? Oh, drawer here. Knob is over here. Okay. A square. That's a square, even though it's a triangle. All right. Why do I need that? I'm going to use that to open that. Boy, we are using measuring tools for everything but measuring. It was a top. That was the other thing. They reused one. It was a roller skate, a skateboard, a rolling pin, and a top. Nail clippers and... Oh. Oh. Is that for this? That's a skeleton. Oh, okay. Gotta make the skeleton look like the skeleton, I guess. Wait, what? Oh, okay. That's silly, but sure, why not? What do we start? Seven, nine, oh wait, no. Three, four, seven, nine. Oh, I'm trying to figure out what I was supposed to push. Car keys and valuables. Wow, this person actually keeps important things in their safe. Good job, lady. All right, here we go. Oh, wow, we're coming up on two and a half hours. I hope we're almost done. So here we are. I should find Pierre and help him with the rituals. Yeah, I think we're almost done. How nice of us to clean up the road for no reason. Okay, we have... I need a special device to lift the handle. Yeah, that seems fair. Uh, missing a piece of stone... Okay, good. All right, that needs to be cut. And this needs a spider key and something to hold up the gate. All right, well, there's the machete blade. And there's a grindstone. Decent machete. Actually, it looked like it was made with Damascus steel, which would make it a very nice machete. But someone did not take very good care of it. Looks creepy without eyes. Bet it looks cre creepy with eyes. Bass relief. Oh. Oh, I thought it was missing like a piece of stone, but that's actually a figure that's supposed to go there. Okay, arrange the plants so they don't overlap. Okay. Uh, let's start here. You are going here, and you use it. You go there, and you. Hmm. No, you're in the wrong spot. You, you, and you. Well, I can't just move over. You go there. 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 Oh, uh, you go there. Ta-da! I am not doing an all-night stream. 
I do not like staying up all night. I, if I will admit it, didn't particularly like staying up all night when I could stay up all night. Okay. Generally speaking, um, it was fun to stay up all night, but at the same time, even as a young person, my body knew it was a bad idea. And that was when I could, like, sleep almost all day the next day. That's not a thing anymore. What is that? It's a bell. I need to unbend this bell ring to get the bell. Okay. It'd be easier if I just saw through this. If only I had a saw! Or an axe! Or another saw! Or, I think a third saw. I think we had three saws in the game already. Okay, a bellows, a thick rag, and the magician's eye. Alright, you need eyeballs, but that is not a thing yet. I need something to lift that up, but I don't have it yet. It's supposed to be. There, it's supposed to be in here. Okay, I don't have a key. Is there anything else I can get here? Nope. Uh oh, I give it. I can use that. Gotcha. Wow, that that is an interesting thing. I'm pretty sure. Actually, I have no idea what kind of saw that is. I bet it would take longer than that to saw through something, though. You came. I need your help. We must hurry. The sun is coming up, and when the first rays hit, the monsters will own our world. Please, find the ingredients for the ritual while I prepare. Here, this will be useful. The sun is not almost up if there is a full moon that high in the sky, my dude. Look, if only we had a shovel or hands that worked. Runes will fit perfectly here. What's over here? Ooh, that's a scraper do thing. Where's the top? What is this? A knight. Oh, he's missing pieces. Okay. And there's sap and the bird. They don't like loud noises. I'm telling you, I can be really loud. You have no idea, people. On top of starting out loud, I'm a mom now, so I am even louder than I used to be. Okay. Oh, we can put the eyes in the statue. Oops. There we go. Come on. Well, that's pretty cool. A dream catcher. Wait, what? First I need a vessel to contain the spirits. Like bellows? Okay, good. That didn't make a lot of sense. Oh. I mean, that's not the order of operations, but yeah, that would work like that, I guess. Night. And the other part of the night... Oh, I guess I need some glue or something. Why are you all the way over there? Weird. Got to glue the night back together. I can make a new amulet here. Why do I need an amulet? What did I, oh, I need... Can I use a dream catcher? No. Alright. Oh, I can use this to get the bell. Don't know why I need a bell. This is where the knight goes. I need something to clean up the dirt. What do I need? I do not need a bell. Okay. Oh, I need a jar that looks like that, apparently. And something to go on whatever this is. Oh, I bet I can use that to get the sap. The bell is to scare the crow. Oh, I can yell way louder than that. Sheesh. 
Okay. What do I need resin for? What do I need? Well, I guess the bellows is probably for the... Yeah, I guess. I'm going to make a resin amulet. That's not normally how that works. I guess I need some other pieces. Is the bellows for here? Okay. I need to make the fire stronger. I just did that. Add some resin. That'd make the fire stronger. I could break up that broom and put that in there. Huh. Where am I supposed to be? I'm supposed to be nowhere. Okay, that means that I need to be doing something with the stuff I have. Oh, I used the resin to fix the night. All right. Yeah, that makes sense. And now there's two nights. Okay, what do we got? I need a frog and whatever that is. And a torch and a, what is it? Ouroboros, something like that. Froggy. Um, and the Big Dipper and one wolf moon and oh there's a torch oh there's the ouroboros and a rose and a potion and a bat and a scarab beetle and bird skull and a scythe and i'm still looking for the moon and a frog all right so a scythe a moon and a frog there's a spider there's a wolf. Oh, I guess I just needed the wolf. All right, so a frog and a scythe. Froggy, froggy, froggy. Why are you froggy? Hat. What is a frog? Oh, he's cute. Aw. All right, I need the scythe. There it is. A key. Which is for this. For some reason, they locked up that poor suit of armor. Where is the emblem on his chest? I don't know. It wasn't my turn to watch it. Now we get the spirits. One. I need a tool to catch them, which would be the dream catcher. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's not how dream catchers work. In that I am 100% sure that's not how dream catchers work. <laughs> dream catchers are to catch nightmares at night while you're sleeping. That little bitty shovel would not be able to do that that fast. Another dead dude. Oh, that must be the top for this pyramid over here. Oh, and we have to make a new amulet for the suit of armor. There would be no pattern on the top. The pattern would be on the bottom. I don't think that dude was holding that right. But let's get going. It's getting late. Okay. Arrange the tokens around their corresponding elements. Select a large circle to rotate it. Select two adjacent tokens to swap them. Okay. That shouldn't be too hard. Let's see now. Uh, what do we got? Fire's at the top. Where's the rest of the fire? Okay. And this is water. Wait, let's get this water. And this water. And let's see. These trees. Let's see. These trees. Wait, that's right. That's right. Yep. You can all over here. Oh, I see that. Yep. Okay. Cool. Get them. No. The ritual is ready. Now, seal. Walter. <laughs> 
We did it! I couldn't have done this without your help. Thank you. Now, let's go home and celebrate. Okay, sure. <laughs> Monsters chained in the basement. Yeah, it's not a great place to keep them, and also it's kind of creepy. Um, that was longer than I thought it was going to be, but not by a lot. Ah, I was kind of hoping we could get through that one in two hours, but I guess I was talking too much. Not a big surprise there. <laughs> this one, the plot made sense. Just the things we were doing to move the plot forward didn't make sense. And the voice acting in this one was, I, <laughs> was better. Yeah, I know you missed Dad. <laughs> Oh no, Dad! Um, the next game... Well, next we have to do the bonus episode. But the next game is the one that came out this year. And it is, I think, behind the door or something like that. And, I mean, today is Halloween. And I still have to edit and post the last video. So I don't know, should we do the last Halloween one or should we go back to Haunted Hotel and save the last Halloween one for next Halloween? We have to think about that. I kind of love this background with all the skulls. That looks really cool. That is a neat background. Um, I don't know either. I want to start, I've said this about a billion times now. We're going to go back to Haunted Hotel because there's like 19, of, 19 or 20 of them. And I want to start up a run through all the mystery case file games and then I want to add in another one that's just random. Uh, we're definitely going to do the bonus episode for this one next though. Not today though. And we can look at the extras when we do the bonus episode because it's getting late so let's just close that. Ta-da! So, good night, happy Halloween, and I'm Fate Touched and I will see you later. Bye!